not got no need for your help. Have no fear, good man. Our labors shall be done quickly. The prowlers to be banished for good. Milton, look. Get out. In the flesh. Hail, Witcher. Let us go inside and greet you as befits an old friend. And you, fear not. We shall put an end to the rule of outlaws soon. Found your message on a notice board. You see, Palmerin? I told you. The griffin at White Orchard. I knew that were we only to follow the tracks of its slayer, we would in the end find Geralt. Milton de Peyrac Perrin and Palmerin de Lanfor. Good to see you both. Been years. We are short. We share your joy. You must forgive us our, uh, surroundings. When we pledged to place the village under our protection, the village elder gave us this hut as our lodgings. He swore it is the best hut in the village. Get involved in some squabble? We discovered that in retreating, the Redanian garrison that left this land still is at the mercy of numerous plagues. The tyranny of bandits, the most onerous among them. These planterers shall soon descend on this village to collect tribute. Milton and I will dissuade them. We are both sworn to fight injustice and oppression wherever they rear their heads. The matter does not concern you, of course, but do us the kindness of waiting. Once we have dealt with these marauders, we have a matter we must present to you. No point fighting bandits. Kill these and others just as bad or possibly worse will come in to fill the void. To cast a blind eye upon the evil. There is no honor in it. Can't stay here to protect these folk from the dangers that come their way daily. Saw what I saw. Heard them urge you to leave these raiders alone. Must have good reason to do that. Do you suggest that should we help, we assume responsibility for their fate? For their lives? This burden we cannot agree to bear. Geralt speaks wisely. We know neither this land, nor its peoples, nor its customs. And we have come with another duty altogether. Uh, ah, how I long to return to Tucson, where all is simpler. Soon, my friend, soon. First, let us convey our missive to Geralt in the manner tradition ordains. So fess up. What brings you such a long way? We are to deliver Her Grace the Duchess's message in full, with all due ceremony. For tradition... ...is sacred in Toussaint. All right, fine. Most Honorable Geralt, Slayer of monsters and all Ifels nefarious, which prey on the defenseless of this world. Whereas never have you been known to deny help to the innocent, nor leave widows and orphans to fates undeserved, answer you now our present summons. Free us from the beast which floods our streets with blood, and sows panic in the hearts of rich and poor alike. Come to our aid, Witcher. Thus humbly beseeches you the Star Cross City's most gracious protectress. Her illustrious highness, Duchess Anna Henrietta. Shall you answer her call? Might be the most fervent request that I take a contract ever. And the most polite. And now we've got all that behind us. I want to hear more about this beast. Some kind of monster? Just guessing. Most assuredly. Though no one has caught a good look at it as yet, our only sure witnesses, the bodies massacred in a brutal, horrid manner. Look, some sketches drafted from descriptions given by those who claim they glimpsed the beast. Each quite different. To my mind, these witnesses lie. How many victims so far? Two. When Her Grace learnt of the second, she discharged us immediately to fetch you. Promising grants of land and fortunes in gold, should you answer her summons. An ill wind blows, Geralt. The beast cannot be tracked. Folks say it wields black magic. Also, both victims were nobly born, and the start of a tourney draws near. Uh. 
I sometimes think back to all the contracts I've ever taken from Sovereigns. Can't name hardly any where I came out ahead. You cannot be thinking to refuse. <sighs> no. Just struck by a thought. How the Duchess can sometimes be... Mm, demanding. So you accept the contract? Excellent! We must set off at once. We long wanted this land searching for you. Yet time is of the essence. Ready to go, soon as you're packed. Ha! Ah, then post haste to Tucson. To Tucson! Toussaint, the land of love and life. Exactly how I remembered it. You will find Beauclair has changed some these past years. Walk about when you have the chance. You will see for yourself. To me, place always seemed straight out of a fairy tale. Knights errant, elven palaces. You insinuate that we are somehow odd? I shall prove you wrong. This I pledge on the Heron! Is love born of wisdom, Witcher? So, Guillaume, out with it. Which fair damsel inspired you to vow to kill that filth? The most beautiful among them. If he wishes to guard her name a secret, he need not reveal it. You I do not know, sir, nor seem you a knight, yet still I am profoundly grateful, nay, indebted to you for your succor. This trophy, sir, is yours. I'll take the trophy, why not? Could find someone who'll pay to buy it. Put up a good fight against the giant. Got experience battling monsters? None. In Tucson we mostly chase bandits. But I vowed I'd bring my heart's champion the head of a monstrosity. As the famed Gottfried, known as the Giant Killer, did. You don't mean to hunt the beast, I hope. The matter's best left to Geralt. Another challenge awaits me. Yet if Geralt is to hunt the beast, he ought to know. It struck again. The river surrendered a corpse. It washed up in the meander by the cockatrice. Damien de la Tour's guardsmen are there already, securing the area. Securing the area? Better go there now before they trample any tracks, manhandle any evidence. 
Set forth, then. I shall ride for the city to inform her gracious magnificence that Geralt has arrived. We'll meet later, near Guillaume's tent at the Tawny Grounds. I shall take you then to see her grace. Brave kid, Guillaume. Parmenin oversaw his upbringing. Guillaume is his kid. Can't get used to the way you knights talk, especially how you switch back and forth between flowery and... Well, you're normal. My servant, in the service of a gracious magnificence. When we appear in her name or speak on her behalf, we are bound by tradition. No one here. They must have removed the body already. That's Hug the girl around. Boots. Make sure Multiple they didn't miss anything. Ducal guard, clearly. Let's see where they went. Got guests. Careful. The body lay on the bank. Blood. Guardsmen pulled these nets out of the water, then cut the mutilated body free. Gonna dive in. Make sure. Accessory clearly. Be nice to know where they took the corpse. What now? This isn't the site of the murder. We know that. Current brought the body here. Corpse got caught in the nets. Guardsmen pulled it out, put it in a boat, and took it somewhere. Need to find out where. I'd like to look at the corpse before it starts to decompose. The inn. Its patrons must have seen the guardsmen. Which direction they took. We should ask there. One thing. Found a handkerchief in the water. Monogrammed DLC. Mean anything to you? Delacroix? It cannot be. Was it he the beast slew? Seems so. Knew him well? Long past. We were close friends once, but our paths diverged. He was a man of extremes, standing by his companions no matter the odds, fighting his foes to the bitter end. Foes? You have a lot of them? I understand. I shall have to leave you soon. 
returned to court. Barely got back to Tucson. A knight in the service of her illustrious highness knows no rest. Truth, could that be the musty scent of fresh pate? Naught else, Sir de Peyrac Perrin. I see time has not dulled your senses. We would be honored if you would join us. Uh, your companion as well. But why do I not detect even a whiff of crayfish chowder? No soup today, on account of there being no crayfish. I reckon you've not heard, but all I caught was a corpse. I awoke at the crack of dawn, as I do each day, but when I looked up, I beheld a blood-red sky. This corpse is precisely why we're here. For the man whom you've invited to join you at the table was summoned from a far-off land by her gracious magnificence. He is tasked with tracking and killing the beast. We invited two men to join us, yet since Sir de Peyrac Peyron in temperament is more akin to hare than hound, I surmise the other is the hunter. With whom do we have the pleasure? Name's Geralt. A humble introduction. You've clearly not tarried long with Sir de Peyrac Peyron. Spare us the petty insults. Geralt is a master of the witchering trade. He has questions concerning the beast's last victim. I was the one to find the corpse. The sun had just risen when I awoke, sat straight up in my bed, looked out the window, and beheld a sky red as blood. Ask her, please, or we shall be here till winter. Need to examine the body. Know where they took it? They ferried it across, then loaded it on a cart and hauled it to a cellar at Corfo Bianco to keep it cool, see? What? Why, Corfo Bianco is Baron Russell's estate. When he learns they've turned his cellar into a morgue, he'll set his hounds on them. While you were gallivanting about them... Who was that woman who just left? Didn't... Doubtless Lilis. The it is... I told... Such it's... Thanks. Corvo Bianco... Some... Ooh. What's in the works today? Swilling wine, rolling in the hay?
What's in the box? Okay. Swimming. Sounds like a fight. Have to hurry. Damn it. Kill must still be here. In the summer. Gotta be. Footprints. Small bare feet. Lead deeper into the cellar. Cannot let you leave. How long are you gonna make me wait?
What have you... No, you're so your needs they are ready today.
to speak to him. All right. What's the... Master... Not always. Could go either way. Still... What? Power and... and who... Um... I must now. Are in like... Either way. Who's fun? Close. Some... Whatever is... This is... I saw... It. Who's go... Guillaume. Yeah. Great luck. Let's go. Behold, as the last gasps of life seep from the beast. Master Geralt, do what you must. Finish the deed! It's suffered enough. is done! Christ be the victors! Guillaume. The lot. Smile. Geralt. We must... talk. Give him. You shall talk later, in the medic's tent. Geralt, magnificent! Breathtaking! Your grace. We knew that to summon you was a brilliant idea. We are delighted, raffish, to have struck upon it. And I'm truly... Uh, honored. See to our young hero. Hop, hop. For we must make off with Geralt. We should talk. We had been long awaiting your arrival. Had nearly lost hope. Then suddenly, that entrance, so spectacular. Your Grace, my contract. I'd like to discuss it. Naturally, but not here. We shall need Damien. He let the investigation pending your arrival. But whatever could he be? Come, we must find him. Tell us, have you come alone? Or did Viscount Julian accompany you? Wish to see Dandelion, Your Grace? 
Yes. I mean, no. Ugh. Yes. But solely to tell him we regret. Yes, deeply regret rescinding the death. If we could... Ah! Your Grace. Greetings. I examined the... Also, first, I've... Dame, are the legends... Yes, your... Hmm. That title... Lovely. Is it yet? Thank you. How did... Crespi... Crespi was... Howdy he done? Quite unusual. He had... So he... So it's... Sec... In the... With the... F criminal's fear... Do you believe... His body... Someone... It's not up. So... First two victims were not... The same. He made of... Found a... Delacroix... Lots of... Might be all the knights of honor. Beast honor. Can't just let's think. Milton. Hang up. Milton. Damien. You're rather. We must first. Damien. And you, which. Poison. Grace seems right, right at home wind. in the saddle. It's clear the path! Clear the way, I said! It's here! Just round the corner! Hurry! We must go to where the game is being held. The participants must find a unicorn's horn, a golden fish, and a phoenix egg. With these in hand, they can deduce where the hare, Milton, hides. I mean we need to find those things too? We've no other option, but time is of the essence, so we shall have to break the rules. They say a great deal about it. Do monsters have mamas and Second, I shall show you. you will get hold. Golden, please look there. The unicorn, the gold, all clear. Fiorano of the twelve ninety vintage. I do encourage you to try. Now that sounds lovely. The courts are thought to like this. Perhaps an apple will work. Or some sweets. We would not be in. Do you really? Hey, for. Who's that? Cheating is what it is! Sirs, we must teach this scamp some proper sportsmanship. Listen, he didn't break any rules. True, he won fair and square. We were unlucky, that's all. We must try to grab the next clue. Gardens are huge. You're better off on horseback. Entirely inappropriate behavior. A complete collapse of social norms. Golden fish. 
should be easy to spot once I'm under. What the blazes? Did someone just dive in the water? Perhaps that's the way to do it. I'm sure, if you're a peasant. What a scout. Mm -hmm. But my is he man. My is Hey, wait. Stop. It's important. King Cormorant Saya, accept this offering we bring. Prithee cast upon us your merciful... As the... When us... Please, Your Grace. We do not please. We act out of the highest necessity. All shall be explained later. But it's against the rules. I am the rules. Geralt! At last. Got a key and a clue. And I've another. Show me yours. Who wrote this drivel? I begin like a groan, hollowed out with ease, then end like a mouse with a head of hard cheese. Starting with what heads heart cheese. Why, it's Greenhouse. Hmm. There are several. Greenhouse. I'm here. This belonged to you, maybe? 
It did, but you may keep it. I've a new one. I do not know you. I've done you no harm. Yet first you butchered a Bruxer who was dear to me. Now you pursue me. Why? You've killed four innocent people, at least. And you? How many innocents have you cut down? I don't kill innocents. Murderers, though, you bet. I'll soon be done. I've but one left. And you, should you not stand down? And once you're done, intend to leave? Go kill somewhere else? No. I intend to live <sighs> happily ever after. I won't let you kill it. to stay where you were. Regenerate! I know you're in trouble. I can help. I'll help myself! No. He's my friend. Yes, Geralt. It's me. Regis? I... You all right? All is well. All's in order. Wounds such as these heal on vampires in moments. But we've not seen one another in ages, my friend. At least in human terms, that is. How's this even possible? Last I saw you... I was a bubbling, shapeless smear, having been rather spectacularly melted into a column of a certain castle. In somewhat better shape now, as you can see. Hardly peak for, mind you, but were I human, folk would think me a demigod, I dare say. I'm sorry. What happened? It was my fault. Never got a chance to apologize. No need, Geralt. Bygones. I did not have to join you on that expedition. No one twisted my arm. Local serial killer seems to obey you. Maybe you could talk him out of it, convince him to stop murdering. Why do you think I've come? 
It shall not be easy, as Detlaf can be rather stubborn. Though you must certainly recall that neither do I surrender readily. So that's his name. He's your friend? You might call it that. Though Detlaf is... How would you humans put it? More bestial than I am. But not to worry. I'm working on him. Haven't exactly done a great job with that. He's killed one night since I got here. At least three others before I arrived. For good reason, I'm sure. Understand, Detlaf is not some decadent shit who kills for sport, or to assuage a dryness of throat or a dullness of mood. So in your opinion, what are his reasons? Precisely what I wish to find out. And then I will convince him of the error of his ways. Got a lot of faith in the guy. Despite appearances to the contrary, you two are quite alike. You've both noble hearts, yet you both are wont to perform ignoble deeds. When circumstances force you to, of course. Remember the year 964? <laughs> that was three centuries ago. Blind fear gripped Rivia, Lyria, and Spala. Women and children were dying. Their mutilated, dismembered corpses littered the fields. Brute of Lyria. Read about it. Chewed up almost two hundred, then fell to a common poacher supposedly armed with a dagger blessed by some prophet. It fell to Detlaf, who then found a poacher asleep in the brush near his snares and dropped the fiend's corpse at his feet. And thus, a legend was born. Huh. Vampires rarely help humans. Must have had his own agenda hunting the beast. You err. He slew it for one reason alone. The monster killed a lad who once in the street had offered Detlaf an apple, expecting nothing in return. Terribly noble of him. You do not have a monopoly on altruism, my friend. Vilgefort melted my body. Detlaf found what was left. As per our codex, he had a choice. To leave me where I was, or to care for me and nurture my remains. He chose the latter. Regenerated me at no small expense in his own blood. Do you know what that means to a vampire? The gravity of the endeavor? Probably same thing it means to a human. You owe him your life. Much more than that. The act itself made us blood brethren. A bond so strong humans cannot even imagine. Which is why I know something ill is afoot. Always had an overdeveloped sense of empathy. Each vampire has a unique talent. One they hone over centuries. It's precisely what renders us so difficult to classify. Detlaf's trump card is his herd instinct, his tribal propensity. In point of fact, he prefers the company of lesser vampires and shuns that of humans. If he walks among you, killing egregiously, it can only mean something's upset him immensely. Gotta find him before something upsets him even more and all Beauclair is awash with blood. Well, we share a cause then, just like the old days. Not entirely. I mean, when I find him, you know. I know you've a contract on his head. Yet your true task is to stop the beast killing, not necessarily to kill the beast, am I right? All in all, sure. Let us find him. By the time we do, I hope I'll have convinced you Detlaf is no monster. Fine, all right already. But for now, evidence is stacking up against him. Hear that? The posse. Knights must have tracked me here. I prefer they not find me here. I've makeshift quarters at Mer Lachaise Long Cemetery. We'll meet there. See you. Witcher, we flew here as fast as our courses would carry us. Yet I fear we're late all the same. Pray, where is the beast? Still investigating. About to inspect this site. Withdraw your men before they trample all over the evidence. Ahem, <clears throat> sirs. We must let the Witcher do his work. Milton's murder cannot go unoffensed.
must allow the Witcher to play. Hey, one in a hole, and a hump in the toes, and you got a hump in the toes. Hey, you got a hump in the toes. Pass the glass, fast. I'm my own master with a bottle in front of me. It's no disaster, not like a frontal love me. They say the diamond at the port has what such extraordinary new colors. Oh, Witcher Garrow! He dyes their skirts. Ha! You've had one too. Show me what you've... In the mood for...
I sus- I- the- I- I fa- Now bring us some thick pudding and bring them right. Uh, Watch I it. see a medic. Nice to. No, see you later. Are the serenity? You need to.
serendipity. I'm so glad you're back. Keep calm. Start no pros. Have I gone absolutely cuckoo? Selling all the dirt Feast till the wine barrels run dry. There is no problem. Welcome. Show me. Payrak Payran falls victim to his own in our disease.
Greetings. We heard of him. Oh. If you no. What do you? Farewell. Good luck. On the payrack, payrack falls victim to his own. Shall be whole again soon. Saw marks are straight and clean. Precision castration, oh. I'd call this. It will all work out. It must. Dried blood stain. It's clearing up. Piece of coat fabric caught on the nail. Heavy on cologne. Smell it'll lead me to the thief. Excuse me. Beauty's chill tears have got a roaring heartburn. Scent leads to this door. <laughs> you mean who are? I got you, Ross. I don't. Mm -hmm. <sighs> All right. And oh, listen, let me. Your reputation precedes you, Geralt. <laughs>
brings peace to our domains. We shall remove the scars of them. What's new, Silverlocks? Looking for diversion? Nothing to see here. Move along. Night, bluff, and wine council. No half Did you say measures. something? of a good thing. I'm happy at least. I imagine you've been Nice tunes. Days pass. The pile of work remains. Welcome home, sir. I am Barnabas Basil Fauti. By order of the Duchess, I shall serve you as Major Domo of Corfo Bianco. I previously served with distinction at the Nibli family manor and in Nazaire with Admiral Rompali, who, as you are certain to know, is an extraordinary demanding gentleman. Whoa, Barnabas Basil. One thing you ought to know. Oh, great. Vineyard comes across. Baron? He was a... No, no. He never... Must said... Shame. Not at all. My... Not in... Behold... Pretty that... In... Been a major domo all your life? Yes, I come from a long line of major domos. My father was a major domo, as was my grandfather before him. As was my great aunt. In fact... She was the one to start the tradition. Great aunt? A hard woman. It is said that already as a child, she knew where she was going and went there. When she arrived in Beauclair, she signed on as a chambermaid at one of the vineyards and slowly worked her way up to Major Domo. She dragged the rest of the family up the same path. The book of lust is hard. The servants' quarters. I occupy the green home. With the Duchess's permission, I have hired a full staff. Their salaries to be paid from the ducal treasury. Nice of her. Not the most sightly part of the estate, I admit. But I think it's worthwhile for you, as master of the domain, to know where the help stays. Baron Rossell ordered the vines in this part of the estate uprooted and olive groves planted in their place. They look beautiful, especially come spring. Don't look at all bad now, either. <coughs> Follow me, please. Down below lies your vineyard, where we grow a strain of Carfanere, one of the world's oldest, aged in oak barrels. It provides for an exquisite wine with distinct blackberry, wild cherry, plum, and cinnamon notes. Marvelous. Have to try it one of these days. Even a horse drops it to ride it with a coat. Nice well. Picturesque. Yes, though it ran dry long ago. During the raucous feasts Master Bolius held, he would order it filled with wine. There's a tale about a guest attending a Bolius ball for the first time and thus unaware of the custom. He had suffered great heartburn and had decided to end his life by jumping into the well. The festivities were coming to a close and the well was nearly empty when the suicidal guest finally jumped. Instead of killing himself, he merely broke his legs. To numb the pain, he drank the wine. Drank himself to death? N not at all. 
When found the next day, he had concluded he'd witnessed twin miracles. The water had been changed into wine, and he had survived. He retired to a monastery in the Dragon Mountains and began preaching the wisdoms of Nebioda. Follow me, please. Monsieur Bolius, his wife Nina, kept a garden here. A supremely lovely place it was. Bit neglected now. I agree. Yet nothing stands in the way of restoring it to its former glory, and once again planting it with herbs and other vegetation. Madame Nina planted diminutive, delicate flowers and herbs here. One might say their aroma still hangs in the air. You're quite the romantic, Barnabas Basil. This served as an additional wine cellar in years of plentiful harvests. Hmm. Bit of work and it'll make a fine stable for Roach. If my lips don't stink of wine, Follow me, please. My wife the cellars, voila. During Monsieur Bolis's time, wine was kept here, but Baron Rossel used it to store olive oil as well. I took the liberty of cleaning up the um, mess, which... I made while fighting the Bruxa. Thanks, Barnabas Basil. Appreciate it. They're so heroic, we had to summon a witcher to do their work. Follow me, please. As you can see, the facade is put it slightly stained, but one cannot deny it a certain subtle southern charm. True, though it could use a bit of subtle paint. And welcome inside. On the left is the master. Not a bad at them. With that, if Think I'll mention almost it. Been think if I'm not own. It's in. I shall. Is there any? Feel I agree. Got these. Oh, the way I. My arm and admiral. Good. Immediate. Will you be needing? And of course. Then set. Of course. Will you be need? Starting. I agree. Starting. I agree. Vineyard Baron. He was a. No, no. He never. Must said. Shame. Not at all. Thanks. Ready to blow. 
innovations coming along. Skin of if you How might I be off? Starting as you fit in the thinking of X. Great. Through in. Is there any? Could you? I know. Fine. Of course. Is there anything? Along. I agree. Yes. It's by this time. Is there anything? Was oh, but yeah, I can't. Is there starting? What a you know? Oh, my, I should. Will you be so good at the eye? Will you be no? What I shall ever fun, huh? Not at all. May the do you wish? Not Congratulate you. May the best. Do you wish play as you would? Fit at your.
congrats you. Maybe as you wish. Thanks. Turn steadily, my Camilla. like an angry wolf. Renovations coming along. I am... You must... Sure. Do you... It was... <laughs> it was... So tell... This... Isn't... Thank... My stomach growls like an angry wolf. Rolling on an empty stomach. Oh, great. Who do my eyes spy from Bors? Where have your journeys taken you last? Here in Beclair, all right passing. and fair. The gods have sent the beast as punishment for Welcome, my. Gwent. Oh, my thing! She Pantora!
the tournament. Am I too late to sign up? We've one slot Welcome. free. Front. I assure you, I... Geralt are... Our... These... They're dis... Nick... Or... We sh... The tournament... You see... Be hope... Oh... Ch no... Ch Here... Already... My... You do... No ointment could help. The serendipity. I'm so glad. Oh! All is in order! Never thought I'd live to see Ooh. times like these. Mama says that if someone's really, but I mean really, really, really. My brother gave me a sword. I named it Nisa. <laughs> Great! Show me... Care for...
You'd best behave, Fred. You're in both here, see? Can't believe it. Simply can't. Nothing to see here. Long live her grace. Three cheers for good Truly, to send a witcher against the beast? It's as if one sought to treat. There is no excuse. Oh, I... In the mood.
up to pay some greetings. I... Uh, uh, wouldn't... Peace to our domains. Flout its writ, Rocky. Oh, no. Picker it all.
Did you kiss uh, our sweet shining sun? Wipe your boots before you take another step. What? Oh, I'm just. I know you. Drink and be merry. Thus spake the prophet Leviota.
are the serendipity. I'm oh, so glad. I thought I was young. Oh! Ah! Yes, yes, like Lord Clerva, her most gracious fight. duchess, has hired a witcher oh. to get at the root. Here in Beauclair, all's right and fair. Come on. The days pass. The pile of work remains. I this burning. Diddly slips. My back. Now, where'd you get them? <laughs> Why don't you all just get off my back? You could make yourself useful. <sighs> Welcome, Snow.
Gwen. Lo and behold. Get it
spores will sprout again. Should destroy the area if I want to get rid of them for good. Faster. Yes. Of course. Show me. Gotta go.
come catch it so bad. What's the side your cat did? Let you smile! Good folk, have you seen these prices? I must have drunk a crazy potion. Welcome, Sn Mind if I... See ya. Is she better? No two ways about it. Oh! I've seen a great many things in my life, but cattle dropping from the sky, that's a first. Patrolling on an empty stomach, oof, dreadful. Slow now. Lamet, my friend. The guards brings peace to our domains. Some blood is rich and brought in chains. The wild wolf himself. The hussies got to waste thin as a rod, but her bum could fit a pack of hounds. Hmm, dear room, welcome. Prefer. Human. Lovely.
Hussey's got to waste thin as blood. Uh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the white wolf himself. Oh. The guard brings peace to our domains. Flouted its rift and brought in chains. Here and uh. there, all's right and fair. Wine is better than stew, for stew you have to chew. Move it. Miserable. No one gives a Meat of the first. Now you need something. I've got it. Of our Duchess has, don't you think?
interesting. Gwent. She summoned him. I wonder what for. So my Duchess has, don't you think? Is to see uh, I sweat dripping down my bum furrow. Probably on an empty stomach. Oh, dreadful. An elder speech. Damn. Professor's journal is long gone. gone. Don't live there. Guess somebody else hearts. found out about it too. Glory be to the end. See if I can find something else. The professor certainly can't do much to help me with my search. Footprints. Narrow and shallow. Somebody small, light. Woman, maybe? Wonder where they lead. Damn it. Trail breaks off. Wonder if the grave robber learned more than I did. Hmm. Won't learn anything else here. Map Yen sent me will have to do. Also, Epitaph mentioned both Elorin and Dolnevde, Valley of the Nine. Hmm. Site marked on the map's all wet now. Sonra Tour flows through there. Must be where the Valley of the Nine once lay. Need to explore the location.
faster. Why do you stick on it? I'm catching so bad. Couldn't have picked some other place to meet. something in Moreau's tomb to activate the entry portal. wonder what surprises this place has in store.
got soaked. Brave rubber was wounded while attempting the climb. Needed to bandage up. Managed to avoid the panthers at least. Someone put a lot of thought into its design. Should look around. Hmm, impressive. It's just decoration. <laughs>
right. Now to find the next portal. Damn it. Back where I started. The next portal. Damn it. Wrong again. Could be some clue around here. Some clue around here. Alright. Now to find the next portal. Portal. Damn it. Back where I started. Preserved organs. Hope their donors weren't forced to give them up. Intriguing as machinery goes, but how do I start it up? Quite the library. Mostly tomes on mutations and genetics. Crystals. Should mount them in the megascope. Missing two crystals. Hmm. This crystal must go here. All crystals in place. Show me what you got. Just need to pick an entry. The 18th of Yule, year 1102. Today I begin my great life's endeavor, one greater and more significant than any I have thus far undertaken, for it relates to me personally, to myself and my son. When fifteen years passed, a beast of the forest assaulted me. A witcher came to my aid, saved my life. I could not know that for said salvation, I would in the end pay by relinquishing any say as to my own son's fate. Had I the skill to turn back time, I would have done so, and perished rather than surrender to the Witcher's my only son. But as it was, on the day when Jerome was taken, I swore an oath on my honor that I would recover my son. Today, following years of research and preparation, I have at last devised a device that allows me to study mutations. If the gods in their goodness grant me but a bit of favor, I shall find a way to reverse said mutations and restore Jerome to a normal life. So, Professor wasn't out to enhance Witcher mutations, wanted to reverse them. Wonder if he managed, and if there's anything in it for me.
Observation 22. Despite applying a surfeit of toxic substances, significantly more than usual, the subject displayed no symptoms of overdosing. I believe this to be an effect of the mutations. Thus, a minor success. This mutation should allow Jerome better to tolerate toxicity. Observation number 30. The mutations do not set in at once. Curiously, they do not develop over a span of time. Rather, for a mutation to progress towards completion, the appropriate mutagen must be applied continuously. The subject does not bear this well, but I found a way to make the mutations less taxing. Invasive. To the mutagen base, I add the albumin of a mutated giant centipede egg. Stored in the glass terrarium, the eggs do not develop. Remain small. The eggs themselves are a sight to behold. Mutated, they are luminescent, emitting a wondrous glow. I can only hope my addition of the albumin will produce no significant side effects. Time will tell. Observation 58. Sometimes failure is the catalyst for success. I've discovered a method by which one type of mutagen may be transmuted into another through the addition of certain ingredients. This is a great day for science. In addition, I observed that today's dose of mutagens brought the subject to the brink of death. He then suddenly awoke, revived, his strength renewed. Not wholly, of course, but he did, in a sense, come back from the edge of death. Whether this is attributable to his mutations or to pure coincidence cannot be ascertained. I must conduct further experiments. Yes. Each mu what I it seems my son must remain no with you forever. I have failed. The time has come to abandon this place. Hmm. So, Professor tried to neutralize the effects of Witcher mutations. Only managed to enhance them, though. You...
and train you know, machine where I go. Gear. And how do I start to drop my armor, leave my weapons? Professor's mutagens might work on me if they did on his son. Well, time to find out.
search it. I have a matter of prime urgency and import. Your wound. It's he. That could. What makes. You must. Vivian. Trigger. In war. She can. Then so. I tempt. I note. T sh got a. I've devoured. Fine. I shall. Meaning. Could you. Sh I. Beside. Mark. Come with me. The marksmanship contest shall pit you against another for the best time and score. He who hits all his targets first wins. Hope my aim's as good as that Cupid's who shot you. Hit the... Once more? Done. Where to? If you would. She's. Now you must. Greetings. Net. My fu- I'm get- You- I'm Who- mm. Have you- Feels like- Splint. May the... That is... Hmm. You have all...
You have... Behold... Accept... The... T Like a lava ghostly grasping but one fair teeth, Geralt's half strewn twixt joyous victory and bitter defeat, Geralt. Sir Geralt of Frithia has trounced his foe, pounded him soundly, immersed him in woe. Your prize, sir. A crossbow adorned with your crest. I congratulate you. Thank you, my lady. The medallions vibrating strongly can only mean one thing. Magic. The explanation is disappointing, I'm afraid. The fragrance I use, it's mixed by a sorceress. To lose to an opponent such as you is a victory of its own. Accept my congratulations as well. Thanks. Good work! In the interim, I managed to determine which tent Lady Vivian occupies. Perhaps you could find a clue within it. You're right. Vivian's cursed in some way. Sensed it when she opened the tourney. In that case, we've no time to lose. Let us go. Yeah. This is... Claw marks, that's clear. Not sure if these left them, and just that it's big, powerful magic at work here. Oriole feather. If you can keep a bruising so belt, dark green and yellow, a tent of seven years, so. is not the only one with a fixed color scheme. Someone approaches, quickly! You were supposed to hoot. We shall speak later. We must return to the tourney now. It's, it's time for the second contest. Sirs, what seek you in my lady's tent? Inspiration? Be gone from here! at the host assembled before us. Look upon chivalry's best and most storied. Come from far lands, here to seek glory. Hear now their names as I shout them aloud. Save her their titles of their presence, be proud. Palmerin, the Baron of Longfall. Linus of Metida. Rinfarn of Atra. Oh, Makaspark of Meicht! Dunimir of Troy! Guy de Boisfren, in service to the Duchess! Delwyn of Craigiao! Count Ty of Dondal! And say of Lyria and Rivia a prince! Geralt of Rivia! For Gregoire! Does it eat? Your tip! Your nap! Your and you! The thought! My hop! Ex. The time! Late! Before! Draw, who pounds the ground? No legion of dramas could make such a sound.
close will he last endure and keep pace? A race of such style, such grace, such speed. To watch was a pleasure, a treat indeed. To honor our entrance, praise each fair night. We shall feast from eve till dawn's. I congratulate you. Many thanks. I... How do you... We must lead the way. So? Her... That is not still... What fans... Of... Not sure. We've still... Too vivid. Too vivid. Ah. Love's not... You say... Her... Head to the... Cow! May the blood I will spill wash away the stain of your cowardice! Let's get this over with. Quick. Three... Two... One! Tell me what you got. In a great glad to my heart, yep. The, the best, the fit, sell it. Follow. Can't wait to take that. Sure, I'd find her here. Vanished, melted into thin air. And that bird. She Bruxa? Flew off. Worth going after. Looks like the bird's leading me somewhere.
off over the hill. Might be quicker to pass through the cave. Witcher. Lady Vivian? Counted on me getting lost. I did. I thought you no different from the knights. Good at tourneys, hopeless in the face of true danger. I was mistaken. So you're not actually a Bruxa? A what? Suspicion I had that you might be a vampire. Certain details seemed to confirm it. Then I changed my mind. Anyway, unimportant. Here you come to this clearing often. This is where it all began. And as I was not able to evade you, save myself from you, then I want it done here. In this very spot, with no witnesses. Want what done? While you are a witcher, you were hired to kill me, were you not? Then do so, now. And do it quickly, I beg you. I shan't resist. Witchers only hunt monsters, and even then, not all. You're no monster. Then what am I to your eyes? Most likely you've been cursed. Don't know who by or why yet, but hope to find that out soon. If you've no contract on my life, why take an interest at all? Did Guillaume put you up to it? Is that why? He wanted to help you. Asked me to do him a favor. Frankly, if I can do something for you, I'll do it, willingly. Why should I trust you? Because the Duchess trusts me? Because I'm a freak, too? Because cases like yours are my bread and butter. You got no- Ah, uh, when she w But a cr- It demand- what happened? Nothing, but in fact, the c and you can't get could tr what? Only one. So they. All right. Consi curse with thing it. Seven. I understand you. I see. I will. Let's. Ah. Uh, you can. No. <laughs> Come. Did you learn? Yeah. Then speak, but I will We were- Good! That'll dip What? Tup. Heard of- Thing- You mean- Theorem. I am pre- Knew that- <laughs> Which me- Don't- What you have- Best true- Third- mm. I'm true, I- I- Indeed- Got it. I know with the none. I doubt it is a ch two right who fuck by the knights who have fight. Let us begin. 
Kraut, Rissaracus! Blood, sweat and tears shall soon follow in bucket. The words that have seen a fight quite so glorious for showing such verve each night to get his safe for grip to. It is. Thanks. I... The wit now entering the. The Titans look stairs, the butchers and cry as wolves, but he cares! The Dams and Spurs are victor and champion! The unequaled! Gregoire de Gorgon! Hip hip hooray! Hooray! And now a few words from our sponsor, the Tufo Vineyard. For strong bones and deep drink Tufo! This year's champion! A sight to behold! He defeated Grégoire de Gorgon! Hail Geralt! Herald! As patron of this grand tourney, his very should. Greeting. I have my two. Sure. I would. But it would. What? No. Is that. Looks to. Be not. I know. She grew. I fear. Why? I might. I do not. Witcher. Worth. You've now. Very well. Everything. you mentioned what became of her die beast so this is my true form my oh that's shut your eyes both of you Kion? yes my love if you become as I am now, I wish you to know, I shall not leave you. Picture yourselves reflected in a pool of water. Focus on that. Now, open your eyes. Might have worked. How do you feel? In general, you feel it change, Guillaume? Yes. What now? Now? Still. Naturally. <laughs> at last! I'm so free at last! Huh? But you will not fly away without me. That remains to be seen, I think. But I too must thank you. Don't mean.
Run, Roach. Don't crowd around. 